대한부인회 회원 여러분, 기빈 여러분 반갑습니다. 대한부인회가 50주년을 기념하게 된 것을 진심으로 축하드립니다. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, it is my great honor and pleasure to congratulate the Korean Women's Association on celebrating the Golden Jubilee in the year 2022. The association was first formed with only about 10 Korean women in the early 1970s for the purpose of sharing meals and cultural connections. As time went on, the group began to provide more support to immigrants from other countries as well. Now for their unique ability in helping those whose dreams were corrupted by language and cultural barriers, the association made clear the vision that all families and individual communities where we work are empowered and supported to lead the stable and healthy lives. Now today, the KWA has an annual budget of over $70 million and provides services to all of the Western Washington through 16 offices in 14 countries with over 2,000 staff and volunteers. This combined effort reaches more than 18,000 refugees, immigrants, every year in Washington State. Ladies and gentlemen, this year marks the 140th anniversary of diplomatic relations between the United States and Republic Korea. In 1882, the Treaty of Peace, Amity, Commerce and Navigation, the first agreement between the United States and Joseon Dynasty was signed. 21 years later, in 1903, 102 Koreans arrived in Hawaii seeking jobs at sugar plantations Many came to achieve the American dream that people of all races would be accepted in this community as a candidate for success. The small, hopeful community of 102 has grown to a population of 2.6 million Korean American today. Distinguished guests, there is proverb saying, so good services, sweet remembrances will grow them. With the Korean diaspora spreading within the United States, in KWA has become a beacon of hope for tens of thousands of diverse people seeking a positive change in their lives. As a consultant of Korea, I'm so proud and grateful for the association for embodying the Korean value of contributing goodness to all mankind. I firmly believe that the pursuit of this noble cause of serving multicultural, bilingual communities, together with the KWA's achievement of 50 years, will be enshrined in millions of hearts in Washington State and beyond. In closing, on behalf of the Republic of Korea, I would like to extend my sincere appreciation to all those who have devoted themselves to the development and success of this association over the past 50 years. I look forward to seeing the noble cause of the Korean Women's Association further grow to reach all of the U.S. and beyond in the future. 다시 한번 대한 부인회의 50주년을 축하하며 또 다른 50주년을 향한 무궁한 발전과 성공을 기원합니다. 감사합니다. I thank you very much.